When I first walked into the, the, the trial area, just it took it took me for six. I'm actually blown away. Welcome, come in, come <laughs> into the jungle. Welcome to the jungle, Dean. And they hit me with this live trial thing, and I genuinely, genuinely didn't know. The public has voted you to take on the Bush Tucker trial live now. Seriously. Yes. <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Sorry to break you like that, Dean, but yes. I kind of had to take a step back because it was just so overwhelming. And then I was given a um, dressing gown, which is quite irony, because back home, um, I always wear dressing gowns at night, very comfortable, but this certainly wasn't comfortable. And that's when the, sh the, the trial become real for me. I feel dizzy, man. OK, all you've got to do is lie back. I feel dizzy. Li li well, take some deep take breaths, deep breaths. Have a sit down, you'll be all right. Oh, I remember sitting back, lying back my head and the goggles down, and there was all this noise going on, and the noise is really a strange sound. And then it just kicked in, and all this stuff came out, and I don't know what the hell it was, and I just remember putting my hands behind my back and reaching around, and I got the star quite quickly. You've got it! You've got it! Well done! Well done! Well done! Well done! You've got the star, come on! Just everything was a blur. Ant and Deck, I mean, given their due, they were quite polite and kind of spurred me on. Oh, no, no, no. The second thing I did was put my head through a hairdryer kind of apparatus and and then my feet were in some crabs stuff. You're right, you're right. You're right. right so listen, 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 calm down, Dean. We don't want you being sick. Calm down, listen. If you want to pass on anything, just tell us you want to pass. If you're feeling sick and you want to pass, let us know. I just remember thinking it will all be right in the end. I will get through this. Get the stars out. I just kept closing my eyes and lay back and think of England. And just hoping yeah. it would all be all right. No. Got one. You got one. Got one. And I know when I got one star... Yeah, one. There's one more. They just one more, one more, one more. And I just, I gave it one big kind of scoop. And luckily, luckily, it was a star. Get him out of there. And I just remember things going in my mouth. Dean, listen, well done. When I got the three stars, um, my adrenaline was pumping and I really thought I could just go on and on and on. This is the menacing manicure. We've got, we've got two boxes here. You've got to put your hand in. Right hand in this one, left hand in this one. There is a star in there. You've got to reach for star the star. Star Yeah. Sticking my hand in something that I don't know what I'm sticking my hand into would, would shock me. And then I just kept, remember, getting my hand right to the end and think, well, there's no star, there's no star. I could feel gunk. It was like syrup. But they allowed me to look in. It kind of made me feel a little bit better. Maybe it's not such a good idea. <laughs> don't, look. Don't, look. don't look. I don't look. look. It's all this this holy. Five seconds. Yeah. Four. Yeah, yeah. Three. Yeah. There two. it is. I've got it. Oh, oh, there was bees in there. Oh, Let's move on, Dean. Don't think about it. Don't think about it. Move on. Left out. Left, left arm. arm. Off you go. I just felt things just nipping, just kind of nipping my hand. <laughs> Enough to give you a little bit of a, a, you know, a little shock. Yes! <laughs> Every part of the trial, I'm getting stars. So I'm thinking this is brilliant, you know, roll on some more. Rub them off, rub them off. The facial part of the trial was the worst thing I have ever encountered in my life. Now this is fruit, but it's called cheese fruit or vomit fruit, OK? Oh, thinking about it now, it makes me feel ill. It's just purely horrible, horrible gunk and, and kind of, I can't explain it, it's just very fishy and very, a bit like baby food. Please, guys, it smells like vomit. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Got one more go. All right, let's, let, let's leave this one, Dean. Let's I tried. Leave. I'm not so fussed that I didn't get that star, no. <laughs> I'm shocked that I even did it. <clears throat> the next one is the scream chamber. OK, there's that noise again. Now, you see this little slot at the top? Inside the steam chamber are eight stars, but only two of those stars will fit. I can't explain to anyone if, if they thought what I was doing might have seemed over the top or kind of far out or whatever, there but you you, I have to find anyone to have not, to not go crazy and, and do silly things. Ah! 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 Got to move you on, Dean. You've got no! about 30 seconds left. If that doesn't fit, try another star, Dean. What's in there with you, do you know? Well done, mate. Let's try and get another one. I remember putting one in, it didn't fit, and all of a sudden, just these things crawled down my feet. 
I've got ten seconds. Right. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, right. I've got oh, please, please give me please. five, four, three, oh, quick one, quick one. two, one. No! Touching something that that I didn't know, and then when when I was out of there and opened the doors and I see it's rats, it freaks you out big time. Nice and easy, nice and easy, nice and easy. And then I just saw these crocodiles. I mean, it's a flipping crocodile. You don't, you don't see them in, 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 in Britain at all. It's a crocodile. It's, it's, ah. And I just thought, you know what? Let's do it. And I got in and I remember just kind of being very squeamish. Ah! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> nice and easy. 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 Nice and easy.